Hey guys, my name is Michael Stanley Chinaza. I'm a student of Binus University. I'm studying computer science. Today, I would like to talk about what it's like to study and live in Indonesia as a foreign student. Before I start, I'm going to divide this topic into two. I'm going to be talking about Indonesia as a whole. And secondly, I'm going to be talking about what it's like to study and live in Indonesia as a foreign student. So guys, as we all know, Indonesia is an Asian country with over 275 million people. Indonesia have different languages, different cultures, different foods and friendly people. Indonesia, which are the capital city is Jakarta, a lot of nice places for students and other foreigners. Indonesian people are really friendly. Especially when you're a foreigner, they want to know everything about you. Especially when you want to speak their language too. They will like you. They want to, they want to know where you came from and uh, so many other things. Indonesia has really nice people and uh, compared to their food, to my own country, Indonesian foods are really nice. They're very, very nice, just similar to my country. And um, the cost of living in Indonesia is kind of friendly it's not that too expensive because of uh, the uh, currency they are using is not too high is uh, the indonesian rupees so indonesia is friendly for foreigners who really wants to enjoy themselves here like you are this kind of person that you like to party around you know like you also like to enjoy yourself Indonesia is a very nice it's a very nice city for you or it's a very nice country for you if I mean see yeah it's a very nice place for you to be you can explore different cities in Indonesia nice places and uh, good restaurants and uh, and good cities so secondly I would like to talk about what it's like to study and live in Indonesia as a foreign student Firstly, we all know that there is always going to be the good side and there is always going to be the bad side. Studying in Indonesia is really nice. It's very good because you have so many opportunities to learn so many other things, not only studying. You learn their language, you, you also learn the way they, they do the things, different type of people. So, in this case, Foreign student life here is like not only all about the school and um, you know reading of books and every other thing. Uh, it's like you you know you you have time for yourself. You could hang around with friends if you then you know try to s get yourself in contact with so many other people who can at least help you when you really need help. Foreign life here is very nice especially when you're a student it makes you it makes you really want you're not this kind of person that you're you're like you shy you're not too open to people if you're in indonesia you're gonna be you're really gonna be exposed to different kind of things both the good side and the bad side so i'm gonna be explaining this based on my own perspective not really someone else's perspective because i don't know how some other student is gonna see it but for me, my life here in Indonesia, I have been in Indonesia for two years and I am a student of Binus University just like what I said before I started this video. I'm studying computer science. So Indonesia has really taught me a lot. I have really experienced a lot in this country. Not only my studies and um, yeah, everyone around me really taught me a lot of things that I don't really need to learn in Indonesia. First I came to Indonesia, I was so lost, like I was confused because this country is not an English speaking country. But I had to find my way because Indonesian people are really friendly to foreigners. So here am I, I'm studying and I'm left with um, one more year to complete my studies. I've re I really like Indonesia so much. Indonesia is a very good uh, country. If you really want to study in Indonesia, I'm going to uh, recommend you to study here. Uh, I don't want to say the bad side of it, but I would like I will go to just go through it a little bit. 
in life, there is always the good side and the bad side. So the bad side, I don't really want to say much, but I will just go through it and uh, so you guys can at least uh, listen for yourself. Uh, you know, sometimes you get depressed, you feel lonely, you feel far from home. So it's a kind of, it's a thing of um, you always thinking about yourself, like um, you're thinking about home, you're missing your families and uh, friends, you know. Yeah, but all those things doesn't really matter if you have some good friends here who can really accompany you for you to forget most of these things. They are all here for you and uh, if you really want to spend your time outside, it's okay because Indonesia is very big. You can travel a around the cities of Indonesia and explore. So, lastly, before I conclude this whole thing, uh, I would like to say something. Uh, let me summarize every single thing I said. Indonesia, living in Indo Indonesia is very good, especially when you know how to speak their language as a foreigner. Things is going to be so easy for you. But if you like, if you don't know how to speak their language, it's okay. There are, many, there are few people who really understand English because as you can see, English is a general language. But when it comes to Asian countries, it's not really strong. It's a less, uh, not everyone hears it. So what I really want to say is that I will fully recommend anyone who wants to study in Indonesia. It's a very nice place. You're going to enjoy it when you come. You're going to see for yourself. It's a very good experience. I've really learned a lot from Indonesia. And I really want to thank you all for listening to me. God bless you all and remain the same. My name is Michael Stanley Chinaza. I'm, I'm a computer science student. So I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much.